Hello, 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 beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new Deadman Mode video. And in the last one, we got absolutely spooned in DKs. And I think my Sigil of Last Recall still remembers that space. So I think I'll go back, try to reach 100kc on both. But I know I won't reach that immediately because the breach is in 45 minutes. Right, I need more charges and we get right back into it. Oh my god, I came back first kill. Archer ring. Dude. This is so crazy. <laughs> another dragon X. Oh, another another dragon X. Basically back, to, yeah, completely back to back. It's still in the chat. Okay, breach is in seven minutes, so I'm gonna kill this Rex and then move on. Uh, seems like our Supreme is on 67, Prime is 49, and then we'll see where Rex ends up on. And I'm really surprised I haven't died here. I've been soloing for the last three hours, I'd say. Maybe, maybe two, maybe three. Obviously, small breaks in between. Very good points and uh, very chill. No PKers. I I feel like uh, I just found the most dead possible time so uh, but yeah this is going to be the last kill for now and then we send it at the breach see how it goes <laughs> this guy already schooled up that's crazy oh yeah starting points 81,700. let's see where we get to first emblem bro kriara going crazy holy shit hit me for like a 70 it's wild, man. Oh, what did we just get? Trinket and emblem. Okay, I think I'll do a quick bank. I'm uncomfortable with my food situation. No, oh, another emblem. Ah, that was the global drop table. There we oh, I'm decayed right now. I gotta focus. Now the question is, is he staying or is he not staying? Looks like we are good, maybe? It's hard to say. Trying to stay in the mass. I think we're okay. Another emblem. There we go. Very good breach, I'd say. Point we end on is 80... 3.8 is that 2000 points i'm not sure uh, obviously in singles you can't get that many points but i don't really remember where we started but i know the loot has been decent so yeah i'm, I'm maintaining these trinkets because the corrupted weapons aren't that expensive right now and you don't lose this on death uh, so i'm just keeping i'm just stacking them we're not gonna open them at the moment it is a little rebuild but that's gonna be it for now i'm gonna get a little bit of sleep and then i'll be back with you guys in probably the next breach good morning i just had an absolutely phenomenal sleep and we got ourselves a casket so let's go ahead and take a look what's inside oh that is amazing sarah the hide body is absolutely phenomenal ancient plate legs meh but this is an amazing item for sarah domin in god wars top it off with a little beginner clue scroll as well Demon feet with rune scimitar ornament kit. I wish you got like uh, points for uniques, which I don't think is the case. You just get it for the completion, but those are two uniques. We take those. The very first breach where I'm not going with a melee setup because it is 9 p.m. So we're gonna go with a full magic setup with a cold shadow sears full void and we're also gonna grab undead and we are gonna be running ninja precision titanium we are risking tuta bows scythe ags claws and potions so let's not die and that is going to be it. the reason why i have spade is because well i if it's barrows i just do not want to ever forget the spade that would be an instant death. But yeah, uh, start in one minute. I'm very well rested today. We'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, the points start 83,877. Oh, and now I can actually kill these guys, the Justice Card people. I don't need to do any crazy running. Oh, immediately Dragon Halley. This might be a lot more chill, we'll see. So, so far, the damage output seems nice. Opa, first emblem. Nice. Ooh. So as long as I hit something once, there's another emblem. Okay, I'm liking this. I'm liking this method a lot. I completely robbed this method from Bodhi, by the way, but I feel like if it was less people, the melee would be super nice, but there's so many people that I think this is just the vibe for the 9pm breaches. Took big damage. 
Not sure from what. Pretty sure a big air is on me. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna quickly bank. There was somebody enjoying some bolting situations on us. Mm, big air on us again. It's funny how they always find me, huh? It's just the downside of having my name. I have to deal with it non-stop being attacked. Still frozen, but I'm still going for NPCs. I'm not gonna run. I'm getting good Slayer XP killing this. Might even get to 99, just chilling. There's an emblem. But I think all in all I'm getting more damage with this for sure. This guy keeps attacking me by the way, it's so boring. Let's see if he keeps going for me or not. I keep pumping, I'm just gonna not, not be phased. We got enough supplies to stick through this. Through this ragging. I think this breach would be really shit if I didn't do mage. Especially with all the attacking that's going on. Opa. Emblem. And weaponry. Nice. Another trinket. Nice. Oh, we got a trinket right in the end here. I think that's it. That's the timer. Yeah, this is a lot better. A lot, a lot better. The points are looking beautiful. The loot is looking great because I'm not running around, just hitting. I actually have time to hit loot, hit loot, hit loot. A bunch of trinkets, a bunch of emblems. This is going to be my new setup for the breaches. Shout out to Bodhi. I was, I mean, melee wasn't bad, but this is just better. Let's be honest. Okay, it is time to start planting these trees all around the game. So let's start by going here. I will start utilizing more of these. I really want to get my farming to 99 anyway, so it shouldn't be too much of a problem, hopefully. I mean, I have freeze escape and that's like my only escape. Otherwise, it's up downstairs and whatnot, but it's going to be a bit sketchy, but I don't think many PKers are PKing at the fruit tree patch. Wait, something absolutely crazy just happened, guys. You will not believe it. You guys remember this account, yeah? My my old account. I'm turning it into a farming magic tree U tree account to farm absolutely ridiculous amount of money. And I just pulled a beaver on 67 woodcutting. And I'm absolutely dripped out on this account. Look at this absolute machine of a demon. Uh, but yeah, we got a pet, our first pet. And it's not even on the main account. That is crazy. And I'm just waiting for this papaya to grow, chopping these two trees whilst we're at it. That's crazy, honestly. All right, all the trees are planted, and now I do think we're gonna be doing a little bit of T.O.B. It's gonna be spicy, it's gonna be exciting. I'm a big noob when it comes to raiding in RuneScape, so a little bit of a learning curve for me as well. But I think we're gonna have fun doing it. This is where you guys turn on me, by the way. <laughs> that would be pretty smart, by the way. Because, like, where the fuck do you go here? I'm gonna send it through the door just to see how it behaves. Okay, so I can't start instantly. You have to talk with uh, Mr. Oh, Mr. I cannot go through this, so that's not an escape. I think maybe you should uh, hide and log out somewhere until he's coming back. Okay, I'll go to this corner right here. But I kind of prefer to just be logged in, by the way, than... Yeah, yeah, okay. Just somewhere that you don't get insta-frozen. Yeah. We can also just chill in here and he can tell you, tell you yeah. it's clear when he's back. We good to go? Yeah. I hope that with precision... I can catch all the freezes because uh, you should be able to, yeah, for sure. I have a cult, but I'm also. Uh... Do you have Zuriels as well, bro? You're chilling. So wait, what uh... happens if we were to wipe? Does everything go into the chest, right? Yeah. yeah. But then what happens? And then if we die again, we lose everything, right? Yeah. Then. I think we just send it. Honestly, like it's fucking tob. What is the worst that can happen? I think you both take north, and I'll try to. Sounds good. Yeah, I'll have to skip the... Um... Yeah, I can just uh, solo hit the other one with no problem, by the way. I, I killed yeah, it so Yeah, the fast. DPS was way too good, so like... Uh, this is stupidly strong, by the way. I think we can do this very fast. Yeah, there should be no problem skipping that. Yeah, there's good damage. Nice. Oh yeah, we should try to do it as fast as possible, because combat achievements are points, right? True. Yeah, I don't have salves, so... Yeah, neither do I, but I don't think we need it, I'll be honest. Yeah, it's so crazy, I haven't done TOB in so long, but this is such, 
which that is actually fun to do with sigils. So we need to get this guy two down as well, right? Yeah, we could almost send it one down, but... Nah, that's a bit optimistic, I think. Yeah, maybe. It would need to be like perfect. It's so random how this came to be, by the way, because I thought I just wouldn't do raids and stuff, because I never have people to do it with, or I don't know people. It's actually kind of cool. Okay, but, there uh... we go, two down, nice. Oh, I could just like uh, claw swipe, to be honest, instead of yeah, wasting. That's, yeah, that's the vibe. That's true. Yeah, this goes crazy, by the way. I don't need any other weapons. Wait, so how much stuff can you get at Nex? Or is Nex just too sketchy to do? Um, So Blazers is camping like outside the room. Ah, I see. Yeah. Could I accidentally school on one of you guys in here? <laughs> Imagine that. I just turned no. it fucking double claw. Yeah, it's guarded. That would be fucking hilarious. Can I do three when it procs? Yeah. Wait, if I just auto-click and I don't click off, it won't hit after it switches, right? Yeah, it uh, de-targets. Okay, okay, good. Uh, this I might not be the best at. I don't really know how this works. Bro, the damage on this goes crazy. We're gaming. Oh my god, it's so satisfying when the claw attack speed goes through, by the way. Just gonna say, like, I might uh, need some food, because I'm fucking trolling. It's so hard to get, like, the rhythm when this shit procs perma. This is so easy, probably, to kill yourself in this room. Yep. Wait, it's 35% spec. I didn't troll it, right? Yeah, it's 35. This is where Ninja is really good. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's fine. We do this, no problem. Wait, he died. Yeah, he got uh, 70 treat. He should be dead now. Yeah. Okay, I'll brew up. And we hit once, right? Once here. Oh, I got stalled, so I'm just running. I think you, I think you did the right thing. The I did. Sigil just, the yeah. sigil left me behind, so I'm just taking it slow on the edges and t-bowing, okay? This is super chill to do. I love it. You good on food? Yeah, yeah, I just uh, want to stay potted. Wait, we got it. Or? Yeah. Oh, nice. Let's go. Do I get any... No combat achievements. The fuck? Not bad. Oh, but I did get like almost 3000 points for this one clear, by the way. How crazy is that? Yeah, there's an entry mode as well, but it's only 25. But you get X20, so you get uh, I 500 think we should points. Do it. We should do it for sure. Yeah, it's 500 points for one entry. Yeah, that, that, it's definitely, that's like a 99 skill, uh, that's worth doing. So when you start, I can just insta enter, which is OP as fuck, I think. Theater of Blood entry mode, there's 12 tasks, by the way. Hey, yo. I live. <laughs> that's crazy, by the way. Okay. Oh, we got a task. Hey, no pillar. Nice. That was yeah. uh, a bit fast. Before webs. There it is. Yeah, we got the... Nice. Two tasks. Even the loot is not bad. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. The, the the best thing is, like, if we get jumped here, I guarantee you they jump on me. So you can just start and we go in. Yeah, hopefully. Nah, trust me. Like, they will go off you immediately. I've done stuff with people all the time and they always jump me. It's so fucking annoying, by the way. Nice. Nice. Oh, I got the can you dance. I don't know what it is, mm -hmm. but I got it. Watch me tank now and choke the entire raid. <laughs> the day I tank is the day we wipe, let me tell you. I'm really scared about tanking now though. Hey, let's go. Oh, we got, we got the task. The speed chaser, yeah, we got it. I got an elite clue scroll. And two usage actually, that's really insane. Yeah, that's nice. That is really good. Uh, give me one sec, Straight back. So, basically, at this point, I clicked the mute button on OBS. And let's just say I was muted for a solid six hours. So here is all of that summed up in just a couple of minutes. So first, we sent some TOB. Just a regular run, nothing crazy. Got some decent loot. Had a little reset and went for another one. This one, we get a purple. We ended up pulling a Grazi Rapier, which arguably is the worst drop you can get from TOB. 
Still ended up selling it for 7 million though. After that, I was a bit complacent. I was waiting for my team members to start the raid and I didn't notice Riz logging on right next to me. He jumped me in full max. I'm sitting there like a cow in my range void with absolutely no magic bonus, no magic defense. Ended up tanking for like, I don't know, 10, 20 minutes in the bank, but I had no magic bonuses to catch a freeze and escape. Especially when it comes to TOB, I cannot even exit the room or enter the raid whilst being attacked. So at that point, I basically just accepted my death. But props to Riz. I don't know how he managed to log in on the exact moment and get a hit off, but sometimes you can just be a little bit unlucky. So after the death, I was a little bit tilted. I lost the fury, I lost the bearing, I lost all the corrupted weapons. So I decided to train a little bit of skilling. Ended up getting all the way to 80 fletching. Also did a little bit of crafting. And then after all of that, I sold a bunch of stuff and got ready for another breach. I managed to end up pulling an emblem and right after that another Zuriel staff with another emblem. Quickly took that to the bank, came out again, got jumped by an absolute demon that I couldn't even see attacking me. And then I got absolutely chanced, but I don't think his feral fighter procced, so I was lucky to survive because my dumbass did not bring enough combo food. Ended up getting out my escape, went to the bank, came back, got another Statius Warhammer, so second PvP weapon, this breach alone, and then after we pulled one more emblem. So then we were contemplating what we wanted to do next, and we decided we're going to send some armadil to work on some achievement diaries that both of us haven't completed yet but also it was my slayer task so it kind of made sense that i wanted to go back there we ended up completing most of the achievement diaries we could and got rewarded with an armadil chain skirt in the end and then we got jumped by a team yet again with vls's and void wakers and we died for some dehydes Okay, well, that was rough. We need to strategically open a few of these. So I'm trying to hit one of everything uh, because they go over your banky. So let's see. AGS, that's fine. It goes over the banky. Another AGS, that's not very good. <laughs> no way, man. No, and the claws. I'm getting complete sheep. Okay, two mechan. I, I just wanted two mechan. Because I need it for the breach. And the, oh my god, four AGSs. That is disaster. Well, at least on a positive note, we did manage to sell an armadil chain skirt for 14 million. That's a nice little 7 million split. And it's gonna, well, pay for the death, hopefully.